Welcome to After Class Tutor. In this video you will learn how to determine azimuths. There are three basic rules for azimuths. The first rule is that azimuths will always start at north and then turn clockwise. The second item is that azimuth angles will always be between 0 and 360 degrees. The third item is that unlike bearings, azimuths are called by just indicating the angle. Now let's work some examples to better illustrate the items we just mentioned. In the first example we are asked to find the azimuth AB given the following information. We start at the north and turn to the right towards line AB. In order to determine the total angle for the azimuth we sum 90 degrees for the northeast quadrant plus another 90 degrees for the southeast quadrant. And finally, we add the given angle. The total angle for the azimuth is 218 degrees, 23 minutes and 17 seconds. In our next example, we are again asked to find azimuth AB. But this time, we only have one full quadrant to add to our given angle. The total angle for the azimuth is 124 degrees, 33 minutes and 11 seconds. Our last example is asking us to find azimuth BA. In a similar way that we noted for bearings, for azimuths it is very important to not confuse azimuth AB with azimuth BA. This is a very common mistake but easy to avoid. This time we have three full quadrants in addition to the given angle. Therefore, 207 degrees plus 34 degrees 33 minutes 11 seconds is equal to our azimuth angle of 304 degrees 33 minutes 11 seconds. That is pretty much all there is to know about azimuths. Thank you for watching the video and do not forget to subscribe to our channel.